Hi everyone, I hope everyone's had an amazing Christmas and that you're having a nice time off. I don't know whether you're working or not. So my plan is, I've been doing a video every day since like the 12th of December because that's when I finished to work. And I'm thinking, it's looking like a lot of the people I work with aren't actually back until the second week in January. So depending on whether I've got it in me, I might carry on making a video every day until I'm actually back to work. But let me know what you think. Are you enjoying the daily videos? Let me know. Well, I thought I would share, share with you what I got for Christmas. And some of you, I think I know you're gonna be a bit baffled by some of what I've got because you're used to what David gives me. So David gives me fashion, jewellery, handbags, etc. But what I get off my extended family is completely different. And normally it's kind of like silly little things or fun things or things that they just think I would like. And some of the stuff I've got here, you're going to think I look like I'm 12 by, by the time I've shown you what I got given. But the first thing I got was from David. And some of you saw this if you watched the Christmas with the show heads video, then you will have already seen this. But um, it is, I already took one out. It is a pair of boots and it's a pair of boots that I've had my eye on for a couple of months now actually, ever since they came out and it's these. These are the Christian Dior boots. They've got Christian Dior written around the top. This is all tweed. Is it gonna focus? Yay! This is all tweed along here and then this is kind of canvas up here and this is the boot and the toe so it's got like a round toe then on the underneath it looks like that and um, as I say I'd had my eye on these for the longest time but you know as I've said I'm not I haven't really been buying well with the exception of one thing I'm going to tell you about I haven't massively been buying luxury towards the tail end of this year and um, that's just because I kind of feel like I've got everything that I want. But when I saw these, I was like, I actually don't have anything like those. But I didn't go and buy them for myself because of reasons that I've told you about. I've not really been buying a whole lot for myself. Although, here's the thing. I have actually bought two new handbags. And I'm going to unbox them for you in a separate video because one of them still hasn't arrived. And I want to kind of style both bags, show you what fits in them, compare them to other bags that are actually similar and a lot more expensive. So keep watching for that. That'll probably be, at, be out in early January. So keep watching for that. Now, the other thing that I got from David, oh, before, I nearly forgot, is when I filmed the Christmas with the Show Hets video... Do you remember I got David to sit here and I got him his presents and he opened them. And when I finished filming, I, I left to go and put it in the, in the video, the clip I just filmed. David was like, no, 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 sit down, sit down, it's your turn. And I was like, what? Because I was really confused because I he'd already given me these. And do you know something? On that tree behind me, you guys hadn't seen it. I hadn't seen it, but he had hit, hidden a red wrapped up box on there towards the top and he took it off and I was like how did I miss that because when I saw it I was like it kind of stuck out like a sore thumb I just hadn't noticed it being there and it was a pair of earrings and I'm wearing them shall I zoom you in so you can see please excuse my face we're gonna get quite close here but hopefully it's worth it that is them these ones here I love them and he got them for me from, um, let me zoom you back out, and he got them for me from one of my favourite jewellers which make or sell antique pieces, so they make their own stuff, so this is a pair of earrings that the jeweller made, but they also sell uh, antiques and I just love going in there and browsing what they've got, they've got so many like art deco looking pieces or just Victorian even looking pieces and I love looking at what they've got and thinking about the story that goes behind each um, thing that's kind of there. But yeah, he got me these and I was just like mind blown when I opened the box. I was like, yeah, how, like so generous of him. I was not expecting it. I did not see it up there. I can't believe he hid it in plain view of all of us and no one saw it. So that's kind of that. Now the other stuff that I got from my family, here is where you're gonna think 
that I've gone crazy, but you know, you see me on camera and you might think you know me, but actually there's, you don't, you know, like this, with all due respect, I don't mean that in a bad way. You know, like the smallest part of me in my life, there is a whole other side to me as there is to everyone. And some of what I'm about to show you is going to give you a little bit of an insight into the other part of me. Okay, the first thing that I got is this. And this will kind of give you an idea. So I'm really into Hello Kitty, as a lot of you know. I'm actually obsessed with Hello Kitty. Fendi have done a Pokemon collaboration and I was actually saying to my salesperson there, I was like, I wish they would actually do Hello Kitty collaboration because I would buy that. I wouldn't buy Pokemon, but I would buy Hello Kitty. But I got this zip case and this I'm gonna be using when I travel. I'm gonna keep my makeup in this and I love it. So that was the first thing that I got. The second thing that I got, which is another silly thing. <laughs> this is what I mean, this is what I mean. I've got given some silly things, don't laugh. You're probably gonna laugh. I normally get given every year a stuffed toy, like a plushy Hello Kitty, every year, every year. And I don't mind it because I really like Hello Kitty and because everyone always buys me one every year, I've got to a point where I'm kind of, without even knowing it, collecting them now. But I got given a Care Bear. What? <laughs> are Care Bears like a UK thing or are they worldwide? So when I was a child, I was into Care Bears and the person who gifted me this said, I just saw it and thought of you when we were all kids together. So I got it off my sister and she was just like, I saw it and I was like, I'm gonna get you a Care Bear. So she did. And it even comes with a certificate of authenticity. I don't even know, should I leave this boxed? Will it be worth something in the future? It might be one of those heirlooms that's worth something in the future, but so, so cute, absolutely love it. So that was the other thing. And that's what I'm saying. Based on those two gifts, it literally looks like I'm a 12 year old girl and that is fine. The other thing I got given is in here and this is a pair of earrings. Let me, oh, let me just open them so I can show you them properly. Oh, I can't, they're like sealed in the box. Okay, so what they are, so I'm gonna go back in, is one's like twisted up, but if you see this one, it's two hoops, and then the second hoop's got crystals around it, and these are 18 karat gold plated. Cannot wait to wear these. As you know, I'm really into my earrings. Everyone knows I'm into my earrings and ear piercings and I would like to get some more in the new year and I am planning on doing it. The other thing I got given is this. So this is a dream to sleep by This Works and This Works are a brand which, like the name says, I, I personally have found that their stuff really does work. And I got given this and I tell you what, when you take the lid off, it smells heavenly of like lavender and it's calming and you've got two things well three things you've got a body lotion and a shower gel that you use before bed and then in the middle you've got this which is a pillow spray and it smells like lavender and it helps you kind of drift off to sleep so i got given that then i got given a candle which is amber amber noir which looks like this and it smells so good that smells so so good the other thing that i got given was a bottle of cartier champagne i didn't even know that cartier did champagne but apparently they do and i got given this bottle which i can't wait to try and there is yeah oh it just looks so so good so i got that then i got given because I'm always cold. I got given like a fluffy blanket and I'm gonna be using this at my desk when I work in the day. I have it wrapped around me because I'm always freezing. What else did I get given? I got given an amazing cocktail set, but it's huge and it's in the kitchen. So I, I'm not gonna show you that because I know that I won't be able to carry it here. And even when I do, it's kind of like major, major, major. What else did I get? I think that could be it you know just like cute little bits that I got given and I really love everything and I love 
just getting things that are personal to you like I, I was actually talking about this on I've got a Patreon channel and I was talking about this on there and I was saying that one question that came up is is it okay to give people gifts from charity shops? And I absolutely think the answer is yes. Depends on who you're buying for. For some people it might go down really badly. But personally for me, I've been bought things from charity shops for Christmas and such, and I love those items because they've been bought with thought as opposed to money. It's easy to throw money at someone and think it's gonna make them happy, but actually it's all about the thought that goes into the product as opposed to how much it actually cost, in my personal opinion. So I'm just delighted with everything I got. I'm so, so pleased with everything I got. And I thought I would show you, it's a little bit silly, there's some silly stuff here, but um, let me know what you got for Christmas. I bet I'm gonna have loads of you being like, I got an Hermes bag and a Van Cleef bracelet, and there's me with like my Care Bear, but I don't care, you know. Um, I'm, I'm so, so pleased with what I got and so grateful um for everything so so grateful for everything so that is what i got for christmas i hope you've enjoyed this remember to come back tomorrow because there will be another video then